Welcome to Rendered AI. We are a synthetic data platform as a service that enables data scientists, data engineers, and developers to create and deploy unlimited customized synthetic data generation for computer vision-related machine learning and artificial intelligence workflows, reducing expense, closing gaps, and overcoming bias, security, and privacy issues when compared with the use or acquisition of real data. Rendered AI makes it easier for users to create synthetic data for enterprise workflows by providing a collaborative environment, samples, and cloud resources to quickly define new data generation channels, create datasets in high-performance compute environments, and characterize and catalog existing and synthetic datasets. Rendered AI offers a practical solution if you're working with AI and struggling with real-world data limitations. It's a synthetic data platform that addresses several key challenges like capturing rare events and edge cases. Getting real sensor data for rare occurrences is tough. Rendered AI allows you to reproduce these events easily, providing valuable data for training your AI models. Overcoming data labeling challenges. Labeling sensor data accurately is a tedious task. Rendered AI produces data that is already 100% accurately labeled, saving time and increasing precision. As an NVIDIA Inception partner, we are pleased to be able to offer the Rendered AI channel for NVIDIA Omniverse, a synthetic data application that allows you to access the entire Omniverse ecosystem through our easy-to-use web experience. The Rendered AI channel for NVIDIA Omniverse makes it easy to leverage Omniverse's powerful 3D simulation and rendering capabilities in the cloud. The Omniverse channel can be customized to allow you to generate high-quality synthetic imagery and simulated sensor data for your AI ML initiatives. Labeling sensor data accurately is a tedious task. Rendered AI produces data that is already 100% accurately labeled, saving time and increasing precision. Reproducing restricted or high-risk data, Rendered AI offers a safe way to simulate and use data that are restricted by laws or involve high-risk scenarios. Rendered AI isn't just for the early stages. It's useful from experimentation to production. It allows unlimited data generation at any project stage, making it a versatile tool for enhancing AI training. The resulting dataset is managed within Rendered AI for easy downloading and use in model training. Our APIs can integrate job configuration, data generation, and access into your model training pipelines. You can even customize data generation by modifying graphs and adding your own 3D assets. The options are endless. We have only scratched the surface of what is possible with the rendered AI channel for NVIDIA Omniverse. I'm going to cover a new method we've developed to allow you to better compare synthetic image data to real image data within the rendered AI platform. Here in the Datasets tab, the rendered AI web interface, I have three datasets. The first contains real satellite imagery I've uploaded from the XView dataset. The second contains purely synthetic data generated on the rendered AI platform containing cranes and shipping containers in a variety of backgrounds. The third is that same data set, but runs through a cycle GAN domain adaptation model that is trained to match the characteristics of the XView data. When we select multiple data sets, we have the option to click Compare, which will run these data sets through EU Map Comparison Tool. Selecting the Fit data set defines what data set we want to compare against. Typically, this is our real data. Now we just give this a name and click Compare. This process will run this data through a convolutional neural network trained on the open COCO dataset to detect generic features found in any input images. Those feature vectors are then run through an AU map dimension reduction operation to reduce the vectors down to three dimensions so we can visualize them on a 3D plat. Those feature vectors are then run through an AU map dimension reduction operation to reduce the vectors down to three dimensions so we can visualize them on a 3D plot. Here we have our plot. The first thing we would notice is that the real data represented by the blue dots covers the largest area. This suggests that the real data contains a more diverse set of features than the synthetic data. Next, we notice that the purely simulated synthetic data, our original non-adapted data represented by the green points, covers an even smaller portion of the data, and that the orange dots covers a much, much broader set of the real data. This suggests that the domain adaptation process moved our data set closer in line with our target domain, when we inspected the images that are out of cluster. 
We can see images with features that are not found in our synthetic data, and we can determine whether these features are necessary for our training effort. Lastly, we can select different levels of the feature pyramid to highlight different scales at which these features are found. This gives us a rich view of our data at every feature level. This tool provides a human-in-the-loop feature level comparison between synthetic and real image data and helps highlight specific areas in which our synthetic data can be improved. To explore additional materials, visit our website and browse our blog section. Check out the Omniverse blog and our Planet Case Study for insightful content. Visit rendered.ai to learn more and start your free trial.